Hello, welcome to Kretasaps. In this video tutorial, I will teach you how to create and configure a nice page with content about your company within your application. This is a very interesting function for your company, since users will be able to communicate with you quickly and easily. In addition, they will get information about your brand. Let's add this feature. To begin, the first thing to do is to access the main panel of the application. Once inside, you can see the access buttons to the different configuration sections. To access the pages that make up your application, click Edit Pages. Inside you will find all the pages and functions. Once inside the section, the first thing to do is to add a function about us. To add a function click the plus. This will take you to a fantastic selection of features for your application. Use the search engine to quickly find the About Us function. Select it and click Next. In this screen you must choose a name for this page. Use a simple name, to help you remember the page. Remember that later, you must assign this page to a menu button. To make it possible to access it. When you've typed it, click Add Page. Well, now we have arrived at the configuration panel of this function. Just as in most functions or pages you can edit, on the left you will find the design tools. With these tools you can edit the page layout, edit the colors or format of the text to your liking. In the area on the right, you will find the possible configurations that you will be able to perform in this function. Finally, use the previewer to check the result of your settings. Making the configuration of this page is very simple. It will be enough with clicking on the field that you want to edit and will open a small window that you must edit. For example, type the name of your brand and a brief description. The schema field allows you to set a function to this element. We will see later. When you have it, click on OK to finish and check the result. Check the change you made in the simulator. Repeat the steps to configure the other options. Notice how in the email address element, we can add a function. The send email function will allow users to open their email manager when they touch this field. Automatically, the recipient will be the email you write. A quick way for users to communicate with you. Let's look at the address element. A click to open. Complete your address. Now. In the schema field, we have the Maps function. If you type your address when a user touches it will open the Google Maps application to find your location. But we can use an internal map, so the user will not leave the application. To do this, click on the Outline button and, from among all available functions, select the Page option. In the list that contains all the pages of the application, it looks for the page of Maps. This page or function, you must have added it previously. With this setting, the user of the application will open a map with the position of your company and its current location. Continue making all the adjustments you need. In the telephone element, the user can tap to call the number directly. In the element of the web address, when the user touches, will open your web browser and visit the address you indicate. Finally, you can add or delete the items you want. If you want to add an element click the plus. If, on the other hand, you want to delete an item click on the button with the icon of the trash. Now we are going to make some small adjustments in the design. We recommend using the element layer to edit in this function. Click to select the item and another to open the configuration window. As an example, I will change the border color. I will select a border of the solid type. 1 pixel wide and dark grey. You can select the color, or type it in the field, click on the button when you have it, apply to finish. See how it is, you can quickly see the difference. Repeat steps for all other items. When you're finished, save your changes and click done to return to page editing. We already have the page ready, but now we have two last tasks. The first task will be to change the background color of this page. Click Style to change the background color. In the Style section you can change most of the styles on this page quickly. 
Ideally, the entire application should follow a color pattern. That's why I'm going to choose a very light gray color. Practically white. Click apply to check the change. Again, click done to return. The second pending task is to link the page we've created to a menu button. I link this page with tab number 4. Click edit to configure the menu. In the preview we see the buttons that are available right now. These buttons correspond to the buttons that we see in the configurator. To add a new button, simply click the plus. To add a new button, simply click the plus. If you select it, in the lower area you can configure its properties. Enter a name for this button and select the landing page. In this case, the landing page is the About Us page. If you want, change the button icon. I will copy the same icon that contains the rest of the buttons. When you are done, click Save and then click Done to return to the page edition. This has been everything. I wish I was of help. See you in the next video. Thanks for your attention. See you soon.